just to have a few quick slides for you guys tonight. Um, mainly just letting you know about some upcoming stuff that we have going on and a few reminders about um, some things in the club. So if you have questions at any point, feel free to just, uh, yeah, type them in the chat. I think that should be up and running um, like usual. Um, but with that, I'll just go ahead and uh, start going through these. <clears throat> So the first slide I have on here uh, is just for voting members, kind of just going back over these requirements um, for those who may have forgotten or who may not have been able to make it to the first meeting. Um, our biggest thing here is just coming to half of our general body meetings, which uh, by being here, you are doing correctly. So um, that's great. And you'll you'll get an attendance code um, at the end to fill out um, in order to track that uh, to track that requirement. Um, other than that, trying to be active um, in some sort of minor board position, being on one of our teams, committees, things like that, um, is the only other thing uh, outside of fundraising events, uh, if any of those take place. Next up, uh, kind of going off of that, uh, some of our staff positions that we still have uh, open at all times um, are just our minor board positions, which are just going to be um, basically helping out in our different uh, focus areas of management within the club. Um, so basically working directly with one of us on the e-board um, to do a variety of different uh, tasks, depending on which uh, department that falls under. Moderators uh, is something that we um, don't have a lot of uh, too much anymore with more auto moderation uh, being implemented, but we still welcome. Um, and then committees are pretty similar to the minor board in that um, you're just going to be expected to not quite commit as much time, um, but still a great way to get involved um, and help out with some of the stuff that we do. And then this next slide also might look familiar. Um, this is for our Buckeye Leagues. We have extended signups, um, I believe through October 21st for Buckeye Leagues. Um, so if you know of any friends that um, you know might wanna play between League, Rocket League and Valorant, um, we highly encourage everyone to sign up. It's free to play. Um, and yeah, we're looking forward to just some fun uh, intramural competition. Um, let's see, these matches will run uh, sometime starting the week after uh, those signups close, and then probably through the end of November, maybe the first week of December. But I believe that's um, when finals come up too, so it, it won't butt up against those, uh, or won't overlap at least. Um, and then with that, uh, just a few upcoming events we have this month. Uh, oh, this that date did not change for Buckeye League signups. Um, but that is going to be October 21st uh, for Buckeye League signups closing. And then October 27th, that's a Friday. Uh, I think that should be the, yeah, the last Friday in October. Um, we'll be having a Halloween social night with OSU Esports. So that'll be in the uh, Lincoln Esports Arena on campus. Um, and uh, look out for more details on that in terms of what's going to be involved. But I would expect lots of games, um, potentially some food, meet new people, um, and just come hang out for a couple hours. Um, and then lastly, just will be our next general body meeting, uh, which will be the first Monday of November. That happens to fall on the 6th. Uh, 6th, excuse me. Um, and that is all that I have written down. Um, here's an attendance code. For anyone who is interested, feel free to scan that with your uh, camera, fill that out real quick. Um, but yeah, other than that, um, I, I'd be happy to build any questions you guys might have. Uh, I signed up for Buckeye Val as a free agent, but they sent me an email that I needed a team. Do I need to worry about that? Uh, I don't believe so. Um, as long as you finish the whole sign-up process as a free agent, um, you should be assigned a team as soon as they have uh, all the sign-ups closed and are able to sort everyone out. All right. Well, everyone, have a good night. Uh, yeah, keep studying, and uh, see you soon.